Hello my crafty friends. Welcome back to my channel and another month of 10 on the 10th. This is a Christmas card collaboration hosted by Kim of Metal Scrap and Chick here on YouTube. And every month we make 10 Christmas cards so that we can be ready for Christmas and not be pulling our hair out. <laughs> I wanted to show you what I made today. And there are also the links down to the other collaborators channels if you want to go and watch them after you're done with mine these are all the supplies I used it's the different inks delicata silver I used, I used die cuts to make these I use this stamp set and it comes with dies, coordinating dies. And this is the Martha Stewart collection, some of the pieces that I had left. And this is a hint that what I did to use to make my last card. So let's get started. I, I used my bigger pieces first and I just did the uh, five and a quarter by four with that. And then I did the opposite colors here. There's the red in, in that little necklace and the offering from the rabbit and then the holly berries. Believe in the magic of Christmas. And then here's another one. It went this way. I had one of each, one that went landscape and one that went portrait. And these are snowflakes that I had from Lawn Fawn. I think I put them away already. But they're just, they cut out a bunch of little snowflakes, so I used those. I had one sheet of this silvery paper left, the cardstock heavy cardstock and oh I didn't stamp that one yet okay and this I happen to have one of these silver ones left from another project and then I had a full sheet of this left so I went ahead and used it believe in the magic of Christmas that's in the delicata silver and another one Similar to this, I matted this with blue. This went right across the holly berries and the silver. And then I had a couple of these bows left over. Believe in the magic of Christmas. And there's a little cardinal right there. And I only used one cut apart. I couldn't seem to make the other ones fit. But this one was pretty, I thought. And I use a, a bunch of pattern paper here. Oops, and I didn't do that one yet either. Here's another one with snowflakes and some more of that polar bear pattern paper. Believe in the magic and wonder of Christmas. I had some of these left over, these inserts. And here's where I used one of my brads. And I backed this on silver. This was the only piece I had, but it worked out really well. Joy and believe in the magic of Christmas. And this one is one of my fancier ones. See all the glitter? That's my Wink of Stella. And the Woodland Green Nouveau Drops. And Joy. Believe in the magic of Christmas. And this is, I had just enough of this paper to make two. So I spiced it up with some Wink of Stella also. And this is rhubarb crumb. No, this is red berry. Okay. And last but not least, 
Here is the, it's an all over die, I think. It's the quilting one from My Favorite Things. This is the original. And this is the very first card that I've used this on. I've had this for a couple of years. But this is the first card that I attempted with this. So I just took a bunch of different pieces and I glued, I glued everything on separately. And there's, there's two of the snowflakes piece. And I used another insert, believe in the wonder and magic of Christmas. And I put a little bow on this one. So thank you so much for joining me. And please make sure you go and watch everybody else's projects. And we will see you next time. Bye-bye.